All right, guys, welcome back to a brand new episode of Ark on the Gaming Evolved Ragnarok server. And right now, we are prepping to go out and tame ourselves a griffin, level 66, not bad. Uh, but first of all, I do actually need to grab some mutton, so we're going to kill one of these sheep here. I'll probably kill this one because it's a low level. So yeah, uh, we're going to feed it mutton basically because we don't have any aloe kibble, which is what you need. Um, and good enough, I have a lot of, um, what is it called, sulfur on raw salt on my horse here. So I can keep making these, and that's going to allow us to keep this mutton for a little bit longer, hopefully. <laughs> hopefully we can manage to actually tame this thing with this mutton. And we don't have to come back and get more at some point because... I don't exactly know all the spots where they spawn. I know a couple spots, I'm gonna go check those, but it might be pretty far away, I'm not exactly sure, so I don't know, it could be pretty bad. Anyway, I've got all the stuff to make a trap on me here. As you can see, I've got all the foundations, I got a bunch of ceilings, got a bunch of pillars, and I have the gateway as well, which is what you need to make the trap, essentially. Um, so we should be pretty good here. How is that doing? Are you full of items already? Oh man, he is, holy crap, okay. Oh, he dropped some. I don't really need all of these berries. <laughs> uh, some of that. Can I uh, take any more? Take a little bit more. It's okay though. I don't really need that much. And I can probably just drop that for now and chuck that in there if I can. No, I can't. It's okay. So yeah, we've got quite a lot of this. It's going to last two hours. Okay, I think we should be pretty good here. Um, so basically, we're going to head over to one of the spots where I know where to find them. Uh, previously, we had found one at kind of... Oh. You see, sometimes when I start transferring items, I get like a weird freeze up. Everybody seems to get it for some reason, but I should probably have just searched up mutton and transferred that way, because that way this doesn't happen. But uh, it doesn't seem to be fixing itself. Sometimes it takes a minute or two. Holy crap. Anyway, um, <laughs> I guess we're going to head over to the spot where we previously found one. I know there already is a trap there, um, so I'm kind of hoping that we don't have to use that trap. I kind of want to show you guys how to make the trap and all that good stuff. And uh, then we're going to tame this guy. How the hell are we still stuck? I don't even know. But anyway, guys, if at any point in this video you find yourself liking this video, be sure to beat the crap out of that like button, and I will hopefully unfreeze any second now. This is so dumb. Okay, so I just wanted to bring you guys back because I wanted to kind of check out this area up here because I haven't actually been up there uh, besides when I was flying around in spectator on single player. But um, I just wanted to show you guys this waterfall as well. This thing's amazing. And I know there's like a tiny cave or something behind that one right there, just where my head is. Uh, I think there's some metal and stuff in there. It's kind of similar to the cave that we have, but it has this massive waterfall going down in front of it and it's absolutely amazing. But uh, yeah, so we're going to head up this way. Um, I think I have to go further up this way to get to it. Um, I think we have to be up on that cliff and we have to walk along there. So let's just run up here first, I guess. Um, but yeah, there's like this really amazing kind of canyon kind of area. I don't even know. It's like it kind of looks like a bit of a canyon. As I don't know if that's an actual canyon. I, that's probably what I would call a canyon. 162, not bad. Actually, I don't need any more horses. Why do I keep looking? Oh, Microraptor on me. No. No, 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 no. Oh, crap, he got me. Neutral. Oh, it's a 162. Crap. Kill it. Kill it. Kill him. Knock him out, actually. I want to I wanna get that Microraptor. Can I... Can I... Ah, oh, they stunned me again. Damn it. <laughs> oh, no. He's killed the 18. Knock out the 162, man. Oh, crap. I'm going to die here. Ooh. Knock him out, man. Oh man, I'm almost, oh no, no, I'm almost dead. Come on, let me back on, let me back on, let me back on. Oh God. I knocked him out, I knocked him out. Oh, I did hit him after though. Man, that sucks. I got the 162 though, and I'm almost dead. Oh, dude, Microraptors are no joke. Okay. Um, I gotta eat two of those. Sweet, so let me, let me, oh my God. Let me just grab this. By the way, when I transferred into the folder, apparently they didn't go in, which is weird. Um, let's grab a couple of these. Uh, I guess we're going to have a Microraptor now. I did hit him afterwards, which kind of sucks, but you know what? It's okay. It is what it is. Can't change what happened. I was kind of panicking a little bit as well. <laughs> uh, it's not bad. I mean, plus 48 level, he's going to be over um, 200 anyway. He's going to be 210. I think he should be fine without a uh, thing on him, though. I do need to give him some more mutton. Well, we have a Microraptor now. <laughs> uh, I'm probably going to call them 
flying turkey, which is what we have our Microraptor on uh, Survival Plus. That's his name. Oh, man. By the way, actually, I kind of just want to mention, um, there was an episode, well, f a lot of footage that I probably could have made an episode out of between this one and the last, but I've just decided, hey, I'm not going to use any of that footage. It's like, it was entertaining-ish, but it wasn't, like, top-notch, and I didn't really want to put that out if it wasn't great, but it was, like, a lot of kind of grinding out stuff and kind of just getting different things. We got a fabricator with Neo, we were just running around with Neo as, a as well a little bit, um... And what else did we get? Oh, we got the we got a bunch of uh, trank darts as well. Uh, anyway, I think I'm gonna get this guy up. He's probably gonna take another minute here, and then we'll be back. Okay, well we got him anyway. Flying turkey, nice. All right, let's head on on our journey. So, we need to head up this way. There's like this little kind of cliff that you can run on, I guess. Hopefully, it doesn't end off somewhere though. Yeah, it looks like he can kind of get around here pretty easily. Sweet. Okay, so it's going to lead into like this kind of ravine, which looks really cool. I really want to check out some of this while flying around. So hopefully we get the griffin today anyway. Um, let's have a look down here. There's like, oh, wait, it's like this massive ravine. You guys got to see. Hang on. You can kind of just see like vines and stuff. It's uh, Maybe if I go into K mode, that might be better. Yeah, as you can see, it's like this massive ravine, there's like, there's water down there, I think, and it's like, it's pretty dangerous as well, I believe. But it's awesome looking, the vines and stuff, oh man, looks amazing. Right, so, um, I probably should have walked up on that part, can I get up from here? Can I get up here? No. Apparently not, we have to walk around, okay. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, we're basically at like this kind of canyon area now. Um, I think we just have to go over like just this little part right here and then I think we should be pretty good There's a couple like stone bridges going across as well. It's so amazing Man, Yeah, so you can see the terrain change right now the rocks kind of change different color and Then you are met with this beauty of a sight like holy crap <laughs> This is amazing This is absolutely fantastic looking Man, I really want to explore more of this on, like, on the back of a griffin or something. Oh, gr my god, T-Rex out of nowhere. Where? Oh, there he is. Okay, what level are you? Don't push me off the cliff now. Level 60. Let's run past him. Yeah, so, I think we can kind of just run along, along the side here. I think there's probably, like, a way down at some point anyway. We can kind of just jump down there if we want to, but... I don't see any griffins now, which is kind of odd, because I thought that they also spawned here. Hmm. Okay, let's, uh... What the hell is that? That's a pig. Alright, let's hop down to this rock here. Oh, I missed the rock completely. Alright. Sweet. Um... Let's go over here, I guess. Kind of, uh... Still keeping an eye out, though. I don't know how common the griffins are, but, like, I've seen a couple of them so far. So, I don't know, like, maybe, they, maybe they're maybe they kind of, like, the same as, like, a Tapajara, something like that, because, like, RGs are way too common, so maybe a Tapajara is, like, what you could class them with, where you kind of see one every so often. Just not get all those stupid raptors. Uh, we got some Brontos down there. Man, there's, like, freaking, like, logs going across, like, little kind of, I guess, cliff sides and stuff. Man, it's amazing around here man. and now the rock looks really weird from way back here but I guarantee it does not look like that when you get up close just some sort of weird texture bug I guess man it looks awesome I actually I want to try and head for that purple drop if I can might be a little bit too far away to get it though I think oh no didn't mean to do that oh whoa no 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 that was like a fake cliff do you guys see that oh that's another fake cliff what the hell Oh, man, that could have been bad. Look at that, didn't send me through the world or something. But what the hell is this crap? <laughs> oh, my God. Obviously, that's uh, still a work in progress, I guess. Man, that is dangerous. Okay, well, let's get through this forest here because I don't really feel too safe in here. Um, do we have any griffins, anyway? Well, we, the purple drop is up here. We might as well just go for that right now. We got a um, parasitherium. 
Okay, oh, 168, not bad, actually. I would love to tame that at some point, but not right now. Let's kill this dude. I think the Pariser would probably make a good uh, pack animal with us as well. For some reason, horses uh, do their little whinny thing whenever they get hurt. Like, if they get hurt a good amount within, like, a couple seconds, I think that they just do that little whinny thing. Like, I didn't do that just there. It's weird. Alright, well, we gotta get up to that purple drop. Hopefully, we can get up there now. I can't, can't exactly tell if we will be able to. I do actually have grappling hooks as well. So, maybe that's a possibility. Oh my god, I can't even... Uh, oh yeah, we go up this way. Sweet. Hopefully... Oh wait, no, it's not down yet. Oh, perfect. That makes it even easier. Um, okay, so I don't see any griffins anyway, so I guess we're gonna keep looking, but I kinda just wanted to show you guys this area because it is, it is really beautiful. Like, this map, honestly, like, I don't know why I was not playing on this before. It is a fantastic map. It really is. There's just so many good things, like, the sites everywhere, the biomes are just top-notch. Just everything about it is just, it's just amazing. No wonder Wildcard picked this one to be, oh my god, are you kidding me? I'm not even taking that. No wonder Wildcard picked this one to be the, uh, the first, um, modded map, besides the center, obviously, but the first modded map in their sponsored mod program to actually get into Ark, because they definitely deserve it, the, uh, creators. There's a griffin over there. It's a 24 though, and we got a 60. I wouldn't mind trying to look for like a better level. Um, I know beggars can't be choosers, but like, I mean, those aren't really great levels. And I really would prefer a better one. Is that another one down there? I think we see another one down there. Is that a Bronto tail? No, it's just the Bronto's tail. Okay. So yeah, I mean, they, they do spawn around this wooded area beside the canyons. So maybe I'll head up that mountain there. Maybe. Anyway, we're going to head down there and have a little look. I'll bring you guys back if we uh, see some more griffins. And uh, yeah, I'll see you then. Okay, so guys, I have amazing news. I was coming up to the mountain, which is, I think it's that one over there, which is where we found the first one um, the other day, kind of on our trek over to our current area. And there is a 174 down by the lake over here. Let's get some of these things down. Oh, I don't know where that one went. Um, he's just down killing some, like, beavers and some stuff there. Um, there was actually a alpha raptor that I killed, and I got a bunch of stuff from it. Um, I need to grab the pillars next. I'll put these in here just to save some weight, because he's, like, he's, like, right down there. He could come up at me any moment here, and then I'll have to mount onto the, onto the horse to save myself. <laughs> oh, my God. Can I... Uh, that might be difficult. If I place down two more foundations, I'll get the right snap point. Where are the foundations? Uh, we still got a lot of time left on those, actually. Let me just pop them onto my hopper. Gotta get him before he starts flying away as well. Like that, and then pop our gate on. I'll just take this off of auto close and everything. So then we want to put down our pillars. Um. Oh, there we go. So we want to stack these four high because we want them to kind of be the same height as the gate. Hopefully I have enough in total. I think, yeah, no, I only took out half of them. Still have another half inside of there. Oh, man. Got to do this quick, though. Seriously, this guy could, like, fly away and up the hill, and then I'll have to take down the trap and rebuild it somewhere else. It's a little bit difficult. Oh, we're out of pillars. Uh, pillars, pillars, pillars. There we go. We got another 34. We're good. Oh, man. Okay. Well, I mean, like, we didn't have to look for too long. I actually found another couple low-level ones, but uh, this is the highest level one. This is the... Actually, I think this is the only one I've seen over level 100, which is great, and I'm so happy that we found this one. And I know some of the other guys actually found some really high-level ones as well. I think Flinger got, like, a 168 or something. And I know Axeman has a high level as well. I'm not sure what level he got. Let me place down, please. Oh, my God. Ugh. And, come on, give me the point. There we go. And we gotta, we might have to place one in the center here so we can start getting the ceilings up there. 
because we need those ceilings to be on the very top there. Crap, I can't do it. Let me see. Can I get the horse in and do it that way? Ah, okay. This is going to be difficult. Is he okay? He's still, yeah, he's still down there fighting all that stuff. Um, oh, we had it there. Okay, you know what I might do? If I place down another foundation, um, crap, where are they? They're down here? There we go. If I place down another foundation, I can put it, like, on top there, and I can probably get myself up there and use that as, like, kind of a, a ladder almost. There we go. And then we should be able to place another one up there. Perfect. Okay. Let's get a roof on here. Ah, damn it. Stupid. Come on. Give me the correct snap points. Thank you. Thank you. Good. Did that place? Oh, my God. So awkward. So, so awkward. Ugh, stupid. No, let me off the horse. <laughs> okay. We're going to have to grab a couple of our foundations that we've already placed back. Oh, this is really awkward. I could probably could have just put the ceiling at three high, to be honest, but it's okay. Um, we have four more for the center. I don't even... Oh, no, I did bring enough, but I just don't... I can't place them all down. I can leave a little bit of a gap, though. It should be fine. Okay, I think we're good now. I think we are ready to lure him into the trap. So let me just make sure I've got everything here. So I want to get my trank darts. And I have... I don't have my rifle out. Um, e, no, where's the other one? There it is. Let's grab that. Sweet, okay. So he's like, he's attacking like a beaver. I think the beaver's inside this little hut thing. And I wanted to, I wanted to kind of show off some of the stuff here as well. They have like little beaver dams inside of these little kind of like wooden huts. He's just flying around this thing. I don't even know what to do. Let me grab some bullets, because I have a simple pistol here. I actually got a uh, an apprentice one from the raptor as well, which is great. But I had a normal one here too. Uh, yeah, there it is. Okay. Let's, uh, let's just lure him in a little bit then. Oh, I missed that one completely. Is he going to aggro at me now? No, he's still on that beaver. Oh, God, he's coming. Okay. Come on, buddy. Into the trap. Let me out. Let me... Oh, crap. Let me out. Let me out. Let me out. <laughs> no, no, no. No. Don't don't get out yourself. Okay, hopefully he can't get out of that little gap. Okay. Alright. Oh, that hurt. No, 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 no. Passive. Get away from him. <laughs> Jeez. Okay, now we just uh, pretty much sit here and just shoot him. He's like, he's like, <laughs> just chilled out now. He's like, okay, you got me. Oh, man. Alright. So this shouldn't take too long to knock him out. Hopefully. Oh, my God. Wow, yeah, he was just... <gasps> Can he get out of there? Hopefully he can't. That would really suck, because I don't think we'd be able to get them back in. Oh, wow, yeah, no, we got to get the rest of those foundations on. Oh, I think he might be able to get out of there. Um, I can make a demo gun. Or I got to get the rest of the ceilings in place, not the foundations. The ones that we kind of messed up on, like this one here. And then this one here. Is he out? He almost looks like he's out of there. Oh, man. Okay. Yeah, we know. I don't I don't trust the trap right now. I think we got to get the rest of the ceilings on. He's actually kind of out of the trap right now. Hopefully he won't escape. Oh, we missed that somehow. Even though it looked like it was going to hit. Got to hop on. Oh, man. Okay. <laughs> oh, 174, and it's a really cool looking color as well. He's got kind of like uh, brownish, uh, reddish kind of wings, and he's got a nice crest as well. And his butt kind of looks like it's mostly gray. Yeah, you can actually get some pretty cool colors for these guys I've seen. Some of the other guys have some nice colors as well. 
Oh, this is it, guys, though. Holy crap. And I'm sorry if you guys feel that maybe we rushed to this a little bit. I just, you know, everybody else is getting one, and I was kind of like, okay, well, I kind of want to be part of the part of the crew, you know? And I know we have a couple of cool uh, ideas and stuff that we're going to do together with the Griffins. So I didn't really want to uh, have to kind of stall up everything. Um, okay, I guess we're just going to keep shooting at him then. I guess I'll bring you guys back when he's knocked out. Um, and I'll, I'll tell you how many darts it roughly took. Oh man, we just knocked him out there. Holy crap, that took a lot of darts actually. Almost, um, I mean, I probably missed maybe five, I'd say, in total. But yeah, almost a hundred there. Actually, it's not too bad, I mean, but still. <laughs> Alright, 30 mutton. This should be more than enough. Okay, hopefully, I don't think, like, I definitely didn't hit him after he passed out, but I'm hoping that he didn't randomly take any damage. That would really suck. So, yeah, he's gonna start taming up here. Now, I think you need a little bit of narcotic for these guys, so I should just grab some out just in case. I'll just grab that 23 stack there, sweet, and I might as well stick in the rest of this stuff, because I don't really need this right now. Oh, man, oh, we, we actually just did that. Oh, what the hell is that? Oh, it was a galley. Oh, man. That scared me. I can't believe we just did that, though. That was... That's insane. Um, am I too warm here? No, I'm, a, I'm good in my fur, actually. But, uh, yeah. Oh, my God. Freaking Griffin. Like, insane. I'm so happy that they added this. This is such a cool addition to a map like this. Seriously. It would have really sucked if they had been just like, Hey, you guys, here, here's a new map. You know? But then instead, they went ahead, made this amazing thing right here, and then they also have some other stuff like the giant magma golem, and then they also have the ice wyvern, which you can get. You can get this and the ice wyvern out of the new, out of the two new things. Uh, you can't actually get the magma golem. It's like it's some sort of like giant boss or something like that, I believe, which we're probably gonna take on at some point. It's gonna be fun. Uh, how you doing then? How fast does the food drop again? I can't even remember. Okay, he's going to take a little bit of mutton here in a second. We'll see how much he tames up with our five times taming rates. Awesome. Okay. <laughs> oh, man. I was so excited. Now, they've actually fixed the... Uh, there was an issue on, like, the first day or two when they brought out the DLC. Basically, uh, Griffins actually... It, they said that they needed a saddle, but there was no saddle, and it was actually a bug. As as I explained in a video before, I believe that it was a bug, and it, and it was a bug completely. Uh, they've, they've since patched that, and now you do not need... Oh my god, there's a bear right there. You do not need the, uh, the random, like, saddle that what that didn't exist. <laughs> we gotta fight this bear. Let's knock him out here if we can't kill him. There we go, yeah, he's dead. Actually, as well, when we're around the spot, I might hit up all of these beaver dams and just collect up as much cementing paste as I can find. Um, but I think I'm gonna just stay by... Oh my god, did that say... What? giant beaver dam oh we gotta check that out whatever the hell that is i thought it was just a little kind of hut thing i didn't know that they were actual spawned like structure type things that's awesome okay so 14 percent, and i did not hit him perfect awesome um okay yeah so we're gonna wait for this thing to wake up it's not gonna take too long hopefully and uh yeah then we'll be back okay so he's about to eat his last one here and he's second now and I've already thought up of a perfect name for this guy. We are going to name it P-Tier. <laughs> uh, if anybody is a log type fan of Family Guy, you will understand that reference completely. It is a reference to, I think it's like season three of Family Guy. Um, and I th it, what is it again? Peter, or no, Brian goes to like rehab. I think he gets addicted to like cocaine or something. I think they did like a multiple episode kind of storyline or something like that. And Brian went to like Hollywood or something and then he gets addicted to like cocaine or something. Um, but yeah, then then Peter's like, he, he sees rehab and he's like, oh man, I really want to go there. So he like checks himself in. Uh, oh, we got to unfollow there. So he checks himself in, and then at, at some point, like, obviously he's not an addict, right? And at some point, um, like, the woman there who's kind of like in charge of the place. It's kind of like, hmm, like, I, I don't recognize you. What's your name? And then he's, like, trying to think of, like, a name. <laughs> he's kind of, like, trying to come up with a name on the spot. Let me just write on him just to land him there. He's trying to come up with, like, a name on the spot. And he's, like, looking around. He's, like, uh, uh, uh. And then he's, like, he sees a P on a plate. And he's, like, P. 
uh, 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 and then he looks around and he sees a girl crying and it's like, tear. Uh, and then he's like looking around like a cafeteria and then like a griffin flies by and he's like, griffin, yeah, P tier, like P tier griffin. <laughs> so like he gives his, oh my god, he gives his own name essentially. Like it's, I don't know. I love the randomness of the show. And that was like, for me as like, uh, man, I must have been like 13 or something when I first watched that. That was like absolutely hilarious. And I still laugh today. So when I found out that they are bringing in Griffins, I was like, okay, that's that's the name. That's what I got to call one of them at least. Um, so yeah, P tier Griffin. <laughs> I'll leave a, I'll try to remember to leave a link down below to that little clip. It's so funny, honestly. I don't even know. Like the Griffin flying by, it's just like, what? <laughs> oh man. But uh, yeah, I don't know. Bit of a tribute there to Family Guy. R.I.P. Uh, Adam West. He died the other day. Really sad. Um, okay, so let me just chuck all this crap in here. We're going to check out the griffin a little bit, and then we're going to just quickly grab all those beaver dams, and then we're probably going to bring this guy around a little bit more. Um, the stupid Bronto is, like, stuck all up in my stuff here. Um, let's just pick all these guys up. We actually had one stuck in the ground or something over here, didn't we? A, uh, thingy. Can you, like... Oh, I can get the pillars through him. Okay, that's good. Uh, we just... We lost a pillar. That's great. Oh, man. There's another... There's a foundation around here somewhere. Didn't we accidentally place one on the ground? I don't even know. All right. Anyway, I'm just going to chuck all this crap onto here for now. We'll check that out later. Um, you're okay on everything there? Yeah, you... I think you're fine. Perfect. Okay. Oh, man. We got to check this thing out. All right. Let's, uh, let's just kind of remember where we are. Actually, I do have a GPS, just in case. I don't want to accidentally forget. So, 23-6, 43-4. We're uh, right here. Cool. Also, that's that's kind of the location where I found one, by the way, in case anybody was wondering. Um, so, yeah. Let's, let's check this thing out. Oh, man. Okay. Let's fly all the way up and do our little uh, amazing thing. Actually, how is this stamina? Oh, we got really good stamina and health on this one as well. Look at all those stats. Melee is a little bit low, but I am fine with that. All right, let's uh, let's check this out then. Oh man. Ooh, I'm gonna hit the water. Oh, I didn't mean to do, I didn't mean to go like that low and take that like uh, sharp of a, of a, um, of a turn or an angle, whatever. I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying right now. I was so excited. Oh man, I love this. We gotta pump stamina though, definitely. These guys need stam. It's kinda like in Assassin's Creed when the uh, when the eagle's like flying through the landscape. Oh man. Cause you can kinda like, you can completely turn almost like on your side as well. It's so cool. Let's, uh, let's fly up again. Actually, let's go down and grab some stam and then we'll fly up. So so cool. Oh, actually, we left her. Uh, we left her guy on on passive, didn't we? I think I did. Shouldn't have done that. I gotta go back and change him onto neutral. I don't want to lose that horse. <laughs> that would be terrible. Actually, we didn't get enough stam, did we? Oh, I thought we landed just there, did we not? I press space. All right, let's force feed the prime because apparently that gives him more stam back quicker. Oh, that didn't go up by very much there, did it? Eh, it goes up by a little bit. I could probably get it to like at least 2,000 and still have enough to pump in some more stats here. Maybe I'll bring it to 1,500 and we'll see how how it's going from there. All right, we left our guy over here, right? It's dear, like it's it's weird and it's different seeing the. Uh, oh, I didn't mean to do that. It's weird and different seeing the uh, the landscape from the sky now, because like I've just been on the ground, like going around hanging around with my horse, you know. But now I'm up. I've taken to the sky right now, and it's amazing. All right, you're on neutral now. Okay. That's, um... That's... Oh, there's the castle, actually. Oh, my God. We're, yeah, we're, like, we're really close to the castle, of course, because that's the mountain that we were on before. Man, yeah, we are, like, right beside this thing. Amazing. Oh, man. Okay, let's, uh... Let's gather back some stam here, and then we'll take another little trip. Maybe we'll actually go right up on top of the castle. That might be cool. It's getting a little bit dark here, though, so... Maybe we'll ride the horseback while it's nighttime. I wish there was a way to, like, 
like legit change the time of day if you were like the only person on a server and you went to a bed you should be able to like change it back to daytime i feel like that should be a thing like that would be really handy <laughs> even on official i think oh man this is awesome this is amazing let's uh let's go for a bit of a ride here did not mean to land again damn it i'm not very good at this okay Let's uh, do a little bit of that, a little bit more. Oh, we gotta, I gotta hold four, don't I? Oh, let me just fly up a little bit actually first. I gotta get, I gotta get used to this. It's a, it's a different game mechanic, like the whole gliding thing. You can gain a lot of speed and stuff with it, and use that speed to get higher. Like, if you don't take such a sharp turn, like, directly up after getting a speed boost, you'll get, like, you'll get up pretty high. Like, right there, I think we just went higher than we were before when we went down. And you can tell when you have lost your speed boost because there's kind of, like, a bit of a thing on the side of the screen, but also, like, there's little particles coming from its feathers. You can see that, and when those start to go, then that means that you have lost your speed buff from the flying. Oh, we're almost at a stamp, so let's actually land down right here. Oh, man. <laughs> that is so cool. I actually, I, I gotta see how much damage that, like, ground stomp pounce type thing, whatever the hell it is, like, sky bomb people have been telling me. I gotta see how much, um, how much damage that does. There's turtles down here, so let's test this out. I think the turtles are, like, right here, right? Oh my god, 300, that's really good. Yeah, that's awesome. Okay. Let's get him up here so we can get our stam back and be safe. Uh, we'll pump a little bit more stam, of course. Man, that is awesome. P tier, the griffin. <laughs> so funny, I don't know why. Oh, man. Okay. So our stam is slowly coming back. I mean, the regen is not the worst. It's actually kind of okay. But, um, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> oh, so, um, the plan with this guy is obviously at some point we're going to do some sort of like race through the map or maybe like set some sort of track or something. Cause like these are the one creature in the game that like, you know, you need skill to actually get faster, right? You need to be good at doing the whole gliding thing. It's not like a matter of having more movement speed or something. Obviously now you can't pump movement speed, but you used to be able to before, of, of course. But, um, you know, like the whole kind of gliding thing, like it requires a lot of skill to actually get quicker. So it might actually be like a legit race. Like finally, Ark will actually have an actual race that you can do purely based on skill and everything and I think that's gonna be so fun so we're gonna do some sort of race around the map with a couple people at some point here uh, I don't know when that's gonna happen but hopefully soon it's getting cold up here isn't it oh man how are we looking up here oh my god so cool yeah we definitely got a really nice looking one man all right let's go back down and check out those uh, beaver dams they were like right down here right yeah, this is kind of the area. Oh, there's a bridge right there. I'd never even noticed. This is where our horse is, right? Yeah, there he is. Cool. I'm gonna land on my griffin, Peter. Uh, and we'll leave you there for the moment. I have a level? When did I get a level? Nice. Uh, okay, so what we're gonna do now is we're just gonna leave him there and we're just gonna go over here and gather up all of these beaver dams. Because there's quite a lot, and I want to check out that giant beaver dam, with whatever the hell that is. Like, I gather it's probably just a more dangerous beaver dam spot, I guess. I don't really know. <laughs> uh, let's kill all these guys. There's a Palavi over there. Actually, i got to watch out for them. Make sure that I'm not a... Uh... Oh, no, don't break that beaver dam. No, Palavi, no. There's a lot of beavers around here, though. Oh, man, they do the damage as well. Holy crap. <laughs> oh man, there's more. <laughs> uh, maybe I'll get the griffin and take them out. Alright, come on, buddies. Go down. That's good. We got another one over here. Did I already knock you out? Apparently I did. 
I thought that said level 10, and I was like, wait a minute, we can't get a level 10 on here. Okay, we gotta grab this beaver dam anyway, and then we'll check out whatever the hell that giant one is. Oh my god, all of the submitting paste. Of course I'm gonna drop all this. Oh, no, no, oh, they're already on me, oh my god, no! Holy crap, there's so many! What? There's like, there's 10, oh my god, there's so many, there's so many. Oh no, I'm like stuck. There's like 20 of them there. There's not actually, but you know, holy crap. That's terrifying. Where did they all come from? Oh my, it's like a beaver army. This is terrifying. <laughs> I probably gotta find like some pretty good levels here as well. It's 156 there though. Oh my god, that guy's a really cool color though. But I'm not, I'm not gonna try and knock him out and be safe about it. Actually, those things take a lot of narco and everything to take care of, so I'll probably just leave it even if I do get him knocked out. Oh, there's a 180 though? Ah, oh, I really want that. Maybe I'll try and knock out the 180. Oh man. This is insane. Okay, apparently this is also a beaver taming episode. So silly. Okay, my guy is like almost full on Torpor. <laughs> Holy crap. That's from all the kicking. How many of these guys did we kill? Oh, there's even more of them! Where the hell were you guys? Like, I don't even understand. This guy in front of us. 180 is over there somewhere. Is there any more alive beavers in this, like, stack of dead beavers? One of them hiding, eh? Oh my god. They all just came out of nowhere, though. I'd say there's probably like a bunch of them inside of that um, giant beaver dam thing. There's like three of those over at the other lake, so I'm kind of afraid to go over there. So what's inside of here then? Oh, there's another beaver in here. What the hell? There's just like, there's so many. Okay, let's get him out of here, I guess. Out into the water. Out of the water, I said. I didn't say that. <laughs> Alright, where is he? Oh, this is the 180. Or is that another 180? That doesn't look like the original 180. I feel like maybe there's two. Why is there like two 180s though? That's so weird. Holy crap though. This is insane. Oh my god. There was so many. There must have been like nine or ten that just popped out of nowhere. Oh man, but we got a lot of some ending pace so far, and we really gotta check whatever the hell this is. Is there any more? Oh, what's inside of here? Oh, do I- <gasps> There's another one in there. What the hell? I thought- It's a 102. Maybe I can just kill him with a gun. Uh, Where's my pistol? There it is. Um, okay, well, let's just try to kill this guy with a gun then. Because I don't really feel like kicking in here. If I do, I'm just going to start damaging the structure. This is insane, though. I don't even know, like, is this, is there resources in here, or does it just spawn beavers? The 156 is right there. Come on out of here, guys. Get out of the beaver dam. I feel like I got a gamma up as well. Alright. Is he coming? Okay, I don't even know. What the hell? Oh no! I didn't mean to! Oh, there was a lot of stuff in there, I think. I didn't even have a look. I was just more focused on trying to get back out of my horse. Okay, let me just, let me just grab more bullets. Oh my god, they're all on me now. Oh, there's another one there. Another beaver dam. Get out of here. Don't run from me this time. Actually, stay and fight me. Okay, I'm just gonna chase this one. Is this 180 just keeps running away? Got him out anyway. That 180 just keeps running away and coming back. I do have potatoes to feed him as well, so that might be a uh, really good tame. Where is the beaver gone? There he is. Oh. Yeah, let's just kill this thing. 
I don't need you. Kill this one inside as well. There's another beaver dam right there. Did I already see that one? I can't even remember. My horse is taking a lot of damage in here, though. Oh, God, there's so much freaking cementing paste. That's like a thousand. Yeah, we just got like a huge amount there. Holy crap. Oh, is that the is that a 180 or what? Do we not just have is there two 180s? What level are you? Female 180, what are you? Was that a 180 or was that something else that I saw? Oh my god, go, die, just go out or die. Okay, what level is this one? This is the 156, right? Oh, that's another 180, it's another female. I knew I saw two 180s. That one's out, I'm just gonna leave that one. I gotta tame this one though. There's a 156 in here somewhere. I don't think we killed that. My horse is so hurt, though. I don't really want to do anything with this thing. Let's grab out some potatoes. How is this thing doing, anyway? Guess we could just start taming them. It's going to take a little while, though. Oh, my God. Oh man, well you know what guys, um, as much as I'd like to take out the griffin a little bit more, I think this is probably going to be the end of this episode. I'm going to probably just stick around with this guy for a little bit and gather up the rest of the semantic paste that is out here, because I pretty much have killed all the beavers. Oh my god, what the hell is that? Oh, there's more. We gotta go check that. Whatever the hell that is, we gotta go check that. Also, what's eating things here? Is there a compi? Yeah, there's compies. all these things probably just kill this 180 as well because I don't really want to deal with it oh my god but yeah um maybe we'll just go quickly over there and check out that thing and then we'll probably end off because like holy crap we've done so much in this episode this is probably like a really long episode again that's a 180 compi no it's 108 never mind uh yeah holy crap okay let me give you some of these Let's go over there and check that thing out. Hopefully there's no more beavers over here, though. I really don't want to have to kill anymore. I feel like I've already killed enough for the day. Holy crap, there's just so many. This is cool. This is really cool. Is there cementing paste to be had here? Oh, there is. <gasps> Dude, this is cementing paste heaven. This whole place is like cementing paste heaven. Oh, like, there's separate structures. I mean, like, it's super hard to get here. Okay, where the hell did you come from? I don't even understand. Where are they coming from? They're just, they just seem to be around. Okay, you just run away or something there, buddy. I don't really want to deal with you. Oh, man. Okay. Right, let's just grab the rest of these. But, yeah, there's just, like, it's super hard to get all of these, like, this area cleared and safe and everything to actually raid the dams, but like, holy crap. It's, this is ridiculous. The reward is, it's it's immense. There's just so much semantic paste here. You don't even have to go around collecting for this stuff anymore. You could just come here. It's a very large salmon. Oh my god, but uh, yeah guys. <laughs> crazy, crazy episode. Where the hell, are it's a 156. That one, remember, we never killed that one. Oh man, but it's just been a crazy episode, there's so much stuff happening, um, it's been a little bit chaotic, but we will be checking out the griffin a little bit more in the next episode, and probably trying to get myself an ice wyvern as well, and it's getting super dark, and a compy stole my torch, so I can't use it. <sighs> but, uh, yeah, if you guys enjoyed the video, hit that like button, if you guys want to see more, go ahead and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. It's super dark.